ओके लेट्स गो फॉर क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टी फोर इफ द फंक्शन जी एक्स इक्वल्स के टाइम्स रूट एक्स प्लस वन वेन एक्स इज बिटवीन जीरो एंड थ्री इंक्लूडिंग एंड पॉइंट एंड एम एक्स प्लस टू वेन एक्स इज बिटवीन थ्री एंड फाइव इंक्लूडिंग फाइव एक्सक्लूडिंग थ्री इज डिफ्रेंशियबल देन द वैल्यू ऑफ के प्लस एम इज फोर ऑप्शन आर गिवेन नाउ इट इज गिवेन द फंक्शन इज डिफ्रेंशियबल सो क्लियरली इट हैज टू बी कंटिन्यूस एज वेल using the concept of continuity that is left hand limit equals right hand limit equals value of the function here we put in instead of x as 3 minus h as well as 3 in this part we put 3 plus h under the limit h approaching to 0 so for continuity at x equals 3 we observe k root 3 plus 1 it should be equal to 3m plus 2 that is 2k equals 3m plus 2 right now for differentiability since the function is continuous we can differentiate on both sides excluding the end point that is 3 we observe the result comes as k by 2 root 3 plus 1 should be equal to m that gives me k equals 4m this is equation number 2 substitute this value of k here this gives me from 1 and 2 k equals 4m that is 8m equals 3m plus 2 or so m is 2 by 5 put this value of m here to get k equals 8 by 5 hence the sum k plus m is 8 by 5 plus 2 by 5 that is 10 by 5 resulting in answer as 2 so the correct option is option number 3 right let's move to the next one okay let's try question number 55 the mean of the data set comprising of 16 observations is 16 if one of the observation valued 16 is deleted and three new observations valued 3 4 and 5 are added to the data then the mean of the resultant data is a simple question from stats it is given that the mean of the data with 16 observations is 16 so old mean we can say given to me 16 right so summation of the data can be considered as 16 into 16 that is 256 right now from this 256 one observation 16 is deleted when you subtract 16 you are left with 240 three more observations are added new mean that would be 256 minus 16 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 divided by original number of observations 16 one deleted 15 3 more added that is 18 so we observe it is 252 divided by 18 giving me simply 14 as the new mean so the correct answer is option number 2 let's move to the next one the integral 2 to 4 log x square divided by log x square plus log 36 minus 12x plus x square dx is equal to we can read this integral as 2 to 4 to log mod x divided by 2 log mod x plus 2 log mod of 6 minus x dx now applying the property a plus b minus x this is equal to 2 to 4 log 6 minus x modulus divided by log 6 minus x modulus plus log modulus of x dx correct now adding these two we simply obtain 2i equals 2 to 4 dx or 
i equals 1. So, the correct answer is option number 1 which is 1 right. So, let us move to the next one. Okay, let us try the next one that is question number 57. Let alpha and beta be the roots of the equation x square minus 6x minus 2 equals 0. If a n equals alpha to the power n minus beta to the power n for n greater than equal to 1, then the value of a 10 minus 2 a 8 divided by 2 a 9 is equal to option 1, sum of the roots that is alpha plus beta is 6, product of the roots that is minus 2. From here by multiplying by alpha to the power n minus 1, beta to the power n minus 1, we create alpha n beta n and then we subtract or we can use this result direct. Since A s n plus B s n minus 1 plus C s n minus 2 is 0, where A, B, C are the coefficients of the quadratic A x square plus B x plus C equals 0. From here we can see 1 into S 10 minus 6 into S 9 minus 2 into S 8 is equal to 0 or S 10 minus 2 S 8 divided by 2 S 9 is equal to 3. So, from the given options we can clearly see option number 1 is correct. So, answer is 1 right. Let us move to the next one. 